right, Jake, what day is it? It is coon calling day. Welcome to 2022 raccoon calling season. I'm excited. Are you excited, Keith? I'm excited. I talked to the landowner. He said there is raccoons everywhere. Also, the landowner is Jake's dad. Uh, yeah, we saw a bunch last night uh, just sitting in the house, so we're going to get after it. We've got our first spot coming up. Hopefully, uh, we can get after some. So this spot's a uh, big grove of cottonwood trees that are basically all hollow. Just a coon condo, if you want to call it that. But that's, <laughs> hopefully, fingers crossed, it's going to have quite a few coons in it. And that's what we're looking for. Trees with big holes in them for them to hang out in. And we're going to just set our collar up right underneath it and see what happens. Stay tuned. Welcome to the Bucket Boys. Hopefully, we get on some. All right, just finished up. I think we for sure got one. I heard it fall, that first one. I shot him in the head and that. That hole should go all the way to the bottom. Let's go check it out, make sure. first coon for the year and uh, let's get some more we got a couple about an hour or two maybe before we gotta hit the tree stand again stay tuned He was just peeking. 
He was just peeking. On your own. There are so many places. To look. <laughs> <Around here. laughs> it's, it's crazy. He popped his head out of the hole and shot him. And meanwhile, Keith and I are over here, and there's a raccoon sitting in this old green. I don't even know what the heck you call this. Uh, international. I think that's like an original international harvester. It looks like. Anyways, pops out of there, runs across this tree. Haven't gone over yet. I got a few shots off on him, but we'll go see if we got him. So stick with us. We'll go check. Alright, we're going to go over to this tree. Uh, don't see him yet, but hopefully he's there. Fingers crossed. He fell. Oh, deer scrape. That always looks so much bigger when you pick him up. I knew he was a good one. He's a fat guy, though. Honestly, it's not that uh, early in, well, it's obviously early in the season, it's like the first day. I have a pretty good pelt on him, so. Not sure what the fur market's gonna do this year, but uh, we'll keep an uh, eye on it, and hopefully this will sell later. So, let's go hit the next spot. We're actually gonna head right over uh, down the road. There's a big hollow tree over here. Almost always see one there, so here we go.
All right, so I just want to be pretty transparent here. A lot of these sets that we do, we don't call stuff. I know on some of our other videos, it seems like every set you do, you're going to get a coon out of it. Usually you have a really good success when you know where you're going, but you got to put in a little bit of effort. Uh, we're spending, what, 10 minutes, Keith, on a spot? If that. You don't see it? Head on out to the next one. That's about the uh, best, tip for, or best tip I can give you there. You got anything else to say? Uh, I'm just kind of along for the ride. I'm very new at this. Okay. Jake, uh, Jake's kind of the resident expert here. Uh, we probably didn't see anything here. We had a uh, coyote, a yoke, pop out of this draw when we pulled up, and we we had a little fun slinging lead at him. We did not get him, but we had fun. But uh, ready to go hit another spot? Let's do it. All right. Okay, we are gonna call it quits for the day. It's getting time to get back in the tree stand hunt deer with archery gear. But we just spent an hour and a half calling and were able to get these four. How'd it pan out? I mean, it was good. Shooting was good. Unfortunately, you lose a couple just because of the way that it is. You know, you don't if you don't make a perfect shot, they'll go back down the hole and we get, what, two or three of them do that for us today. Unfortunately. Is, unfortunately, it's fairly common. It's gonna happen just with how you do this. But we did pretty good today. I'm happy. Nice little lunch break from the deer stand. Now uh, get back after it. It was fun. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Uh, we're gonna try to get some more of these out before the end of the year. But without anything else, thanks for watching. That's the Bucket Boys. See you guys later.